హలో ఎవ్రీవన్ వెల్కమ్ టు ఎఫ్ఎంటి గురు షార్ట్ అండ్ సింప్లిఫైడ్ టెన్ మినిట్ సిరీస్ వీఆర్ గోయింగ్ టు డిస్కస్ వెరీ ఇంపార్టెంట్ టాపిక్ వర్జినిటీ అండ్ ది మెడికో లీగల్ ఇంపార్టెన్స్ ఐఎమ్ గోయింగ్ టు కవర్ అట్లీస్ట్ ఫిఫ్టీన్ ఎంసిక్యూస్ ఇన్ టెన్ మినిట్స్ అట్లీస్ట్ ఫిఫ్టీన్ ఎంసిక్యూ రిలేటెడ్ టు వర్జినిటీ it can be related to two true virgin false virgin what are the signs of true virginity and what are the medico legal importance of virginity one very interesting fact is hymenios hymenios is known as god of marriage god of marriage Thanatos is a god of death. Hymenios is a god of marriage. Let's discuss about what are the features of true virginity. What are the features of true virginity? The diagnosis of virginity not based on single factor. It based on multiple factors. are multiple components there are six important components are there one is hymen labia majora labia minora vagina the breast and other important findings not based on only on hymen let's discuss about hymen what is hymen hymen you can see here hymen is a fold of mucous membrane it ha it is around 1 1 mm thickness it has 1 mm thickness hymen when it is intact when it is rigid inelastic when edges are distinct and regular when it admits only the tip of little finger that is the very important feature of true virginity okay hymen hymen tear occur in multiple conditions it can be act of coitus it can be accidents like straddle injuries bad hygiene foreign body solapet masturbation sanitary tampons surgical operations ulceration due to diphtheria or fungus or other infections so all these are the causes not only the act of coitus there are n number of causes are there okay now here on mcq most common hymen the most common hymen is annular hymen so this is the most common one okay most common it can be annular or it can be crescentric both are correct answer most common is annular or crescentric hymen when hymen has two openings this is known as septate hymen septate hymen has two openings when hymen has multiple openings small small multiple openings that is known as cribriform hymen and one very important question is about fimbriated hymen fimbriated hymen it's very commonly asked in exam fimbriated hymen it has notches it has multiple notches it resemble like torn hymen the notches are present only anteriorly that do not extend to base that is about fimbriated hymen it resemble like torn hymen so there are four five mcqs most common hymen semi lunar are it a crescentric or annular two opening septate hymen multiple opening cribriform hymen fimbriated hymen resemble like torn hymen which is notches are present only anteriorly that do not touch the base okay so yes next labia majora labia majora and labia minora labia majora they both are adjacent to each other and in opposition completely close the vaginal orifice and labia minora again small and pinkish 
intact with each other covered by labia majora so there are three important findings the fourth important finding okay fourth important finding is about the vagina the vaginal wall or the vaginal mucosa that shows rugosity in case of true virginity that is vagina is narrow and tight mucosa is rugose and reddish sensitive to touch and walls are approximated so that is about the true virginity vagina feature then one more here pff pff p for posterior commissure f for forkette f for fossa navicularis so pff is intact okay it is intact you can see here so this is forkette forkette the forkette is intact and the fossa navicularis is also intact and the posterior commissure is also intact the vestibule you can see here the vestibule is small okay the vestibule is small clitoris is small so all is our, our vestibule is narrow and clitoris is small last one is about the breast the breast in case of true virginity they are small hemispherical firm areola nipples is nipples are pink and small so this is about the six important features of true virginity okay now let discuss about discuss about what is what are the medico legal importance of virginity the first one very commonly asked is true virgin and false virgin the first one is true virgin and false virgin what do you mean by true virgin what do you mean by false virgin true virgin means true virgin is also known as virgo intacta true virgin is a woman who has never experienced sexual intercourse her hymen may or may not be intact so this is given in case and ready recent edition hymen may or may not be intact second one is the false virgin false virgin is a woman who has experienced sexual intercourse but her hymen is intact because the hymen probably it is elastic hymen or there is a hymenoplasty okay next next important finding that is medico legal importance is divorce consider a girl who is not virgin at the time of marriage is it a ground for divorce no okay so not virgin at the time of marriage is not the ground for divorce pleaded by husband according to hindu marriage act 1955 there is no provision like this okay defamation false rumor about loss of virginity that is punishable under defamation that is 499 ipc 499 ipc so defamation defamation 499 divorce 3 next rape important one is the rape hymen tear is very important evidence in case of a rape in a in a virgin in a virgin so the rape the most common site of hymen tear is posterior lateral posterior lateral posterior lateral that is between 5 to 7 o'clock position that is the most common site of hymen tear in rape in a virgin hymen tear is very uncommon in children because it is deep seated and micro injuries on hymen that can be established with the help of an instrument known as gk rod gk rod 
and there's one more mcq when there is a digital penetration when there is a digital penetration the most common site of hymen tear is anterior and lastly nullity of marriage is a medical legal importance when women are the wife is virgin when there is no consummation of marriage due to impotency of the husband that can be ground for divorce according to section 12 of hindu marriage act 1955 so this is about the five important medico legal aspects of virginity the first one is true virgin and false virgin second one is divorce third one is defamation fourth one is the rape and its uh, importance in medico legal examination lastly nullity of marriage okay so this is about the virginity and the medico legal importance in brief thank you